Morning guys, well uh, the family's gonna have some breakfast and on the menu this morning is ung ung. <laughs> Now, if you don't know what ung ang is, it's a type of frog. It's commonly known as the Asian painted frog or the Asian bullfrog. The Thais call it an ung ang because that's the sound it makes. And uh, they're rather cute actually. They're kind of short and fat. Here, yeah, take a look at this. Their ebbers are pretty. And that there is an ung ang. Look, an escaped ung ang at that. <laughs> As you can see, Dan's got quite a lot in the bucket. They breed prolifically this time of year because the rains are coming. And uh, locals go out and catch them and eat them. I said this the other day, if you've never tried frog, uh, give it a go. It is extremely tasty. I like mine fried in olive oil and then just a bit of salt and pepper. And I generally eat it with steamed rice. They are extremely good to eat. Well, Pong's just... Uh, finishing up preparing the duck food and then we're off to the farm. We just had the guy that's gonna drill the holes for the post come on the farm and he's done the lot already. So all 32 holes took him about an hour and a half. So brilliant, we're gonna go down and see uh, what progress he's like. Not long now, we're gonna go to the hardware store again today and see if the aggregates available and uh, then we'll be uh, well and truly on our way to putting up the new fence. Well, we've got the uh, steel posts. We just brought those on site. The other guys uh, just delivered the sand, the aggregate, and some cement over there. So brilliant. Now I said yesterday that uh, the guy charged just a uh, hundred baht. He actually said this morning, "I'll, I'll do it for 90. <laughs> I couldn't. I nearly fell over. Um, obviously, we're going to give him more than that. We'll give him a couple of hundred baht. Uh, again, it's a neighbour and it's a community thing. You know, the next time he needs help, my father-in-law will help him out. So it's as simple as that, and that's the way it goes. So basically, we just pay for the gasoline. It's fantastic. But he's drilled all 32 holes, and you can see that uh, he's made a rather good job of it. That's pretty deep, but I'm going to get one of the poles now to... Uh, see if it slots in there and okay and see if we've got enough room around it for the concrete fabulous isn't it, it does make life much easier you know when the community pulls together and uh, this is what it's all about here looks like we're in for some more rain though so um not really sure if we're going to be doing too much today it really is a case of having to uh, beat the rains now as you can see pines are hard at it Well, I suppose I'd better give her a hand, I? Right, I'm going to get to it, guys. Well, we're back on site and we're going to sort out the concrete now. So we've already uh, made a hole to uh, mix it up in. Well, Pi did. <laughs> I, can't, I can't tell a lie. I sorted out all the posts, marked them off, brought them all over here. So they're all sitting there waiting. And then Pi is over here. She's just mixing up the first batch. Okay there, honey? Yeah. She knows how to graft, I'll give her that. I'll give her a hand in just a second. All the um, holes are now dug, as you know, and uh, yeah, it's just a case of uh, mixing up this concrete and getting these posts put in. It's gonna take a while. There's uh, 32 posts. And we're gonna start off with the line in the duck pen. Because those ducks and chickens are scratching around, obviously we just don't want them filling up the holes with mud again. Well, it's all good progress. Can't complain at all. It's nice and overcast, which means it's not overly sweltering, although I'm pretty hot already. It is humid out here. But we'll get a start on this and uh, see how progress takes us today. Well guys, this is our first post in. As you can see, it's nicely cemented in. Now what we did, we poured some concrete in the bottom of the hole just to give it a base so the steel is not sitting on uh, wet ground. That will save it from rotting. 
no doubt you're wondering whether it's straight or not. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> so here we go. So this is the test, isn't it? Take a look at that bubble. How nice is that? Well, Pi's just down there cleaning things up. She does like to make things look neat and tidy. So uh, yeah, it's a good thing, isn't it? Job worth doing, worth doing well. So there you go, guys. That is the first post. And it's level. All we've got left now is another 31. <laughs> Better get on with it. Here's our little helper look. Well, things are moving along just nicely. I'm uh, really, really pleased. As you can see, we've got a load of posts in now. And it's beginning to look, uh, yeah, something proper. That's nine posts in now. So yeah, it's coming along. Really, really pleased with the progress. As you can see, Pi and I have been mixing the cement by hand. No electric on the farm. And uh, don't know where I could have found a diesel powered or petrol powered uh, cement mixer. Not to worry, we'll get through it. We've already put in nine posts. So uh, we're a third of the way there now. The boss has given her orders and I have to get to it. Right, we'll catch up with you in a bit. More progress in the next couple of hours. Well, it's now late afternoon and we did it. All 22 posts we put in. You can see the whole line of uh, posts all the way there. And it comes around here. This will be where the gate is, these two here. And along here. And around. As you can see, they've gone all the way down there. And all the way along there. Cool, isn't it? So now we've got 10 to install. That's all we've got left. And we had a phone call from the lady at the uh, hardware shop and she said that it should arrive around about Tuesday evening. So it should be on site by Wednesday morning. And by Wednesday, we'll have finished this. Then we'll let it all go off. And then we've got somebody coming to help us with the chain link fence in itself. So absolutely fantastic. A brilliant day, absolutely brilliant. Now I'm sure there's people out there that would like to know how we've done it. So uh, here's the uh, tech spec if you like. Uh, we went down uh, just over a metre. Then we filled it up by about 20 centimetres with concrete. Let that go off slightly. And that way the uh, steel posts are not sitting on wet floor. So after that we put in the steel posts and then filled it up with concrete. And they're buried to just over two foot deep. So it should be more than strong enough to uh, hold up uh, some chain link fencing. Yeah, great progress. Absolutely pleased as punch today. Couldn't be happier. You can see our neighbour's uh, field is now being ploughed over. Now that they've harvested the rice, burned it off, and they're ploughing it back in. And within a couple of weeks, they'll be planting more rice. I said yesterday about uh, Dad's rice, and that's going to take a little while yet. About another three weeks and it'll be ready for harvesting. So all in all, an excellent day. Absolutely fantastic progress. Yeah, I do like that. Again, it will serve a lot of functions. It will be far more secure and uh, yeah, just um, better looking basically. I remember when I first came here and looked at it and uh, they said they wanted to get some more ducks and I did suggest at the time, why don't you fix it properly? But again, it all comes down to money and uh, it wasn't available at the time. So um, yeah, the ducks went in there, but again, they do get out, but hopefully this is gonna stop it all now. So yeah, just fantastic progress. I really couldn't be happier. Just a lovely sight though, isn't it? And as I was saying yesterday, now that we've had all of this rain, 
you can see the mountains crystal clear the skies are really nice the air is so fresh it is fantastic well that's uh, all from this tribe today we've got to get back and uh, we've got duck feed to make up and then we've got to come back and feed the ducks the fish the ducklings and uh, the dogs so uh, yeah it's a busy day but a very very good day a load of progress made couldn't be happier him oh he, he just sat around he playing all day he didn't do a thing look at his little face look oh dear me <laughs> So that's all for today, guys. Uh, we'll catch you tomorrow. Whatever you do, have a fantastic day and stay safe. Bye for now, guys.